Aquiline and said, is a pair really far? Far from where? <laughs> but it doesn't look like my <laughs> Before I talk to uh, about this, let's talk about what Quiliana O said. That is the truth. Is it really far? And let me tell you why, why we feel places are far. It's because of the topic that I want to start talking on now. So I'm going to, you know, link the talks together. The major challenge Lagos is facing today, today, today is the 9th of November, 2022. The major challenge, the first one on the line, is traffic. That's number one. That traffic, you and I cannot solve the problem. It's only the government that can solve the problem. The second one, Akim Oloyon said, those saying that location is far, said the same thing about Badagri, and now it's just 30 minutes drive. Where I stay presently in Ishefun was for some people. Today, plot in Ishefun, your boy is 10 million. Now, the first on the line is traffic, one of the major challenges in, in Lagos today. The second one on the line is housing. So let's look at the two, traffic and housing. The government will not solve traffic for uh, you. Will not solve traffic for yourself. We are all just going to wallow and cry in the traffic, sweat in the traffic. But housing, you are going to solve it yourself. Some people will tell me, "Hey, I think government will do uh, local housing. Government will do housing. Can you afford it? Is it available to you?" Right from when I was small, my mother paid to all these uh, Jack on the building. She did not collect the allocation. I think she got a refund. It was for, I know my mommy will still watch this thing. It was the refund that she now used to buy the land that she built at Akute. I know things are getting better, but the truth is this. The ones that you can solve yourself as an individual, solve it. Now, going back to what Kuliana Ohm said that is a really far. Recently, I think, during the COVID, Governor Sonwolu, Babajere Sonwolu, commissioned the expansion of between Eleko to T Junction shortly after Alaro City. Prior to that time, going to Epe was, was tedious. The road was bad, your cars were sink, we were suffering. At times, going to Epe, you can spend six hours because the roads are bad. But the moment they expanded that road, between Eleko Junction now to T Junction is 10 minutes. Why is that possible? Because the road has been done. Because government has done their part. And that's why so many times we call on government. Make, things, make these things easy for us. If government should do their part, a lot will be easy. You know, a client walked into my office like three days ago and we were just talking and he told me, he said from his house, he, he, he's based in the UK, he said from his house to his workplace, it's two hours go, two hours come every day, but he doesn't feel it. The roads are 